Can I follow? Um, sure. Where are you done? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, okay. If, if uh, with the indulgence of my colleagues. Now, to, to my last point, the President of the United States of America went out and told the entire world Israel's conduct is over the top. Israel's conduct is over the top. So, if it's over the top, what are you willing to do to make it go under the top? We are going to engage with them to, to, uh, on specific, specific areas where we expect to see improvement. What kind of improvement? I mean, we saw yesterday that we they bomb. bombed, so they, bombed <laughs> they killed 120 people, maybe a lot more. We don't know how many injured and so on, or how many among the injured will die, will end up dying, and all these things. And you're saying that this is, you know, you, just what you said. You said that we have seen them bomb up, uh, you know, all throughout. Does that make it okay? Does that make it okay when everybody, including the Secretary of State, including the President of the United States of America, including many leaders in this country, have said, you know, you should not attack Rafa, period, or you can attack it by air? Is that it? We have, made, that we have always said that they can attack legitimate military targets, um, uh, and we want to see them take every step that they can to minimize civilian casualties. As I just said, we have seen civilian casualties come down. But as you and I have, been, have right. Ha, right. as you and I have discussed many times uh, in this room, uh, Saeed, they face a very difficult situation in that Hamas continues to hide itself among the civilian population. So if this was a, a war being fought on the battlefield where Hamas would come out and fight, it would be a much different scenario. Right. Unfortunately, it is not. So Israel faces a very difficult situation. It doesn't lessen their need to do more, um, and that's why we continue to engage with them on this question. But the fact is that you do have a magic wand. You have a huge, big magic I, wand, I, I, and that I'm, magic I'm wand. Glad you, I'm glad you think it's a magic wand. It is, it is a magic I, I, wand. I don't. I, it is I don't a magic think wand. Share that but it, but it, it's real. Oh, it's substantive. But it is you know, a wand. It, it's a wand. I mean, it's, uh, we're talking about billions of dollars that are approved to make this war keep on going. Well, in fact, we have seen reports from the United Nations that telling you, you are a shake away, man, from starvation in Gaza. Nothing is going in into Rafah. No aid. None of this is, is going on. I mean, there are so many so, things that are going on at the same time that the United States can, in fact, use its magic wand. So, Saeed, we have used uh, a number of levers at our disposal, and that is why humanitarian assistance is going into Rafah. In fact, your contention is not true. There were uh, nearly 200 trucks that, I'm sorry, that, that are going into Gaza. There are nearly 200 trucks of humanitarian assistance that went into Gaza yesterday. If we want to go back to the beginning, it is because of the intervention of the United States that humanitarian assistance is going in. We continue to call for more. When the Secretary was there last week, he raised with, directly with the Prime Minister that we want to see Erez Crossing open so that we can continue to do more. And it is that repeated, sustained engagement that we have shown over time has delivered results, and that's why we'll continue to stay engaged. Do you expect, lastly, do you expect that uh, Director Burns is meeting tomorrow, and, uh, or scheduled meeting tomorrow uh, in Cairo, will produce anything? What is, what is your, the feeling in this building on the ongoing discussion? So first of all, I'm going to look around and remind everyone that I'm the spokesperson for the State yes, Department, not, not any other agency, so I'm not going to, I'm not going to speak to uh, 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 the travel of members, the of, members, of, members of other, hold on, members of other agencies in the government. I will say that generally as it relates to um, engagement over, engagement over um, uh, the release of hostages, <clears throat> you heard the Secretary speak to this and say that we think progress can be made. Um, there were a number of uh, really untenable items in the proposal that came back from Hamas, um, but we do believe that a deal is possible and we're going to continue to pursue it um, uh, uh, from this building as well as from others because we think the benefits um, of a pause and a deal for hostages uh, are tremendous. Um, not just obviously for the hostages who would be released, but also for uh, the humanitarian effort in Gaza and for our ability to um, uh, begin to pursue uh, a real and lasting uh, sustainable resolution of this conflict.